What is going on, fam jam? It's another edition of Yeehaw or Hell Nah right here at Georgia. So what we're going to do today is, is go to Jax, to all the boys I've loved before. Now the thumbnail, um, I have seen this artist, and I saw them a lot doing like social media stuff and singing that way. Uh, and it was a bit comedic, it was fun, and I uh, hadn't seen them in a while. So wondered, and this is what they've been up to. So. Uh, let's give this one a shot. Jax, to all the boys I've loved before, the official music video. Fam Jam, let's go. Rolling, rolling, and three, two, one. It's the all new Frog or Prince Show, where you eliminate two frogs to find your one prince. Shout out to all the boys I loved before for teaching me I need a boy. I'm kind of glad they broke my heart, cause. I love two guys from Connecticut with two closets full of skeletons And I couldn't be a therapist for them And I loved a kid from Hollywood, but he cheated on me cause he could And I went full Carrie Underwood on him Carrie Underwood on him for cheating, which is, uh, Before He Cheats is obviously the song that that is referenced to, uh, but super poppy, super fun, but the lyrics are, uh, very honest, and I like the turnabout is fair play kind of feel of, I'm glad that I love these guys because they showed me that I deserve more than that and it led me to you so that's fun also the video being like a dating game kind of thing is really cool so uh, let's see how this plays out Ended up being the producer. How sweet is that? Uh, yeah, so fun, which is what I kind of expected out of what I knew from her past days during social media. And I don't know, it's definitely a pop song. And her voice lends itself well to a number of genres. I could see her going into like a Nora Jones kind of realm. 
and going into like a jazz realm, pop, uh, maybe not country, but uh, there's a lot of different genres and inner genres that you could see her voice lending itself to. She's got a very pretty voice, super high register, which is really nice. Um, and I kind of like that she meshes a little bit of edgier lyrics, a few curse words in there, but matching it with that super pop feel. Love the video. I did not think it was going to be the producer there at the end. I should have known uh, as much as they were featuring that guy. But to play on the dating game kind of feel and give it that full aesthetic, that was really nice. So I think it's an honest lyric song. And I think she absolutely had relationships with people from these states and it didn't work out and she got hurt. And, and that's just dating period is it's difficult to find your person you have to go through some of those struggles not everybody does um, not everybody has to go through it some people find it in high school uh, but not everybody does and so being completely honest lyrically going with a pop feel being a little bit edgier in the lyrics uh, matched with her really really solid vocal work I think works really well so that's really cool I'm really happy I stumbled upon her page, so shout out to Jax, uh, and to all the boys I love before you get a... Yee-haw! Yee-haw. Way to go. Pleasantly surprised with that one. That turned out really, really nice. So, uh, shout out to Jax. Uh, it, you've got a yee-haw. It was really nice, and I like all the combinations you worked with. The honesty, uh, the super feeling of pop but going a little bit edgier with the lyrics. Uh, and I love the music video. The music video was great. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you want to go check that video out, scroll down to the description below. There's a link. It will take you right over to the video page, and you can check it out. And I won't interrupt you over there. If you want to uh, do me a favor, smash that subscribe button on the way down. Every single subscription helps me so much, and I appreciate every one of you guys. But until next time, fam jam, I'll see you later. And I'm out.